we want you to make the most out of your next dream vacation to Bermuda. Let's go, people. Situated just 580 nautical miles off the coast of South Carolina, Bermuda is a British-governed overseas territory rich with history, beaches, luxurious resorts, and an upscale cosmopolitan scene. I found a nice map to help us get oriented. Now there are three cruise terminals here in Bermuda in which your ship may dock. I'll show you right where they are. There's one up here in St. George, there's another here in Hamilton, and there's another one at the Royal Navy Shipyard. There's also one international airport and that's located right up here. As you can see, Bermuda is pretty much shaped like a giant fish hook, all right? And we are right here at the Gibbs Hill Lighthouse. After you brave the spiral staircase, you'll be treated to this breathtaking view. Bermuda is famous for pink sand, and one of the most popular places to experience said pink sand is right here. This is Horseshoe Bay, and one of the reasons you'll like this particular spot is you'll have all the amenities you need for a perfect beach day. Other beaches you may want to visit include Elbow Beach, Tobacco Bay, Clearwater, or Turtle Beach. You can't leave here without getting in this warm crystal blue water. So speak to your travel professional about booking your shore excursions in advance. Day trip charters, scuba diving, deep sea fishing, or my favorite, swimming with dolphins at Dolphin Quest. No matter what, just get out there and have fun. If you're looking for a subtropical climate, well, Bermuda's got you covered. Because of its northern position in the Atlantic Ocean, the summers are hot, yet cools to the 60s and 70s with low humidity in the winter months. A couple of fast facts for you. The primary language spoken here is English, and the currency is the Bermuda dollar, which is based on the US dollar, so one for one. Getting around the nine parishes in Bermuda is easy. The bus service is reliable, clean, and affordable. Taxis are available or you can rent a scooter. No rental cars are available for tourists. And if you rent a scooter, be prepared to drive on the left. That's the opposite of America, Canada, and Mexico. Welcome to St. George's. Did you know this is the oldest British settlement in the world? It's a UNESCO World Heritage Site, and here you'll find cobblestone streets, British colonial architecture, and places to eat and shop. If I've said it once, I've said it a thousand times. When you're on vacation, it's very important to eat like a local. And one of those places I recommend, this is the Frog and Onion Pub. And I have a feeling some pub grub is forthcoming. I'm back out on the exploration front. This is the Maritime Museum. It's located at the Royal Navy Dockyard. It's one of my favorites. Let's go inside. Meet the Maritime Past with interactive displays and artifacts. Plan on spending at least an hour to get the full picture. Here's some trivia for you. Bermuda has only fired one cannonball shot in anger in its entire history, and that was fired from Gates Fort. Now, I suggest you spend a few minutes here at Fort Scour. That way you can get up close and personal with this guy. So the vibe here is upscale yet casual, and I assure you, your next dream vacation to Bermuda is one you won't soon forget. I'm Eric Hastings. Thanks for watching. Start planning your dream vacation today by contacting your vacation specialist.